Hey everybody, I want to show you how a leech is waiting ambush. This leech was just on me and I uh, removed it to this little tree, this little plant bush, this little leaf. And, and it's now sitting there. It was in a very interesting posture just a moment ago, waiting. Now I think it senses me, my presence, and it's moving around again. Yeah, it knows where I am. It's aiming right at me. It's coming right at the camera. It wants me so bad. It had me for a second there. And I, I got rid of it. Now it wants back. And look how it extends its body like that. The uh, uh, anterior sucker holding onto the leaf with the mouth part is reaching at me. Oh, I got the camera. <laughs> it's on the camera. I'll let me get it on my finger again. Now it'll crawl up my uh, um, hand, head towards some uh, warm, blood rich area where it can, uh, usually a joint or something like that, where it can uh, dig in for a, a feast. Um, they uh, like these uh, moist areas of the mountains, these roads like this. I've had them constantly. Every time I stop, I'm getting more leeches on me. I'm probably getting more right now, so I'm walking around a little bit. Probably won't stop there. They usually like to find some place like in a, uh, in a good warm pot spot where they can kind of hang out. Ooh, big huntsman spider right there. Oh, there it goes. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Leech on the one arm and a huntsman spider on the other. There goes the huntsman. And here's the leech. I'm up in the uh, foothills of the Japan Southern Alps. This is kind of a rainforest type of area on a nearly abandoned farm road here. Um, and uh, the leech has stopped for some reason. Curious. I probably got some in my shoe right now. I'm trying to burrow in. It's curious how this leech has stopped. It seems to be, uh, you know, trying to size me up. Very interesting. Uh, that's a great shot right there, isn't it? Look at that. See if I can zoom in a little more. Let me move around and get some better light on this. I wonder if it's biting me now. I don't think so. I don't think that's the best spot. Could be biting me. I don't know. If it is, it's doing it right there. That's where the mouth is. This rear sucker's right there. No, I don't think so. That wouldn't be... Well, it did kind of leave like a little spittle there or something, didn't it? Maybe it was testing that spot out. Look at that. Try to get some better light in here. Come on, Kurt, find some good light. This is, this is really interesting behavior. Seems to be uh, sensing the air. Now I'm gonna go ahead and pull it off my arm again in a second here. Put it back on a leaf and see if it takes up that posture again. Isn't that great? Look at that. It takes some oil to bite in, so I have a little bit of time if it actually starts. Oh, I won't feel it. They secrete a, uh, uh, both an anticoagulant and a uh, uh, numbing uh, compound, so I won't feel the bite when it happens. Okay, let's go ahead and try to remove it back to a, a leaf. And uh, it takes a second to do this. Take it off with this hand. There we go. Kind of hard to pull them off. It came off pretty well. Sorry guys for the rough camera work here for a second. Put the uh, leech. They're kind of hard. Once you've got them on your hand, they're, they usually don't want to get off. <laughs> there we go. Okay, now let's see what it does. It might pick up that posture again. This is, of course, a Japanese mountain leech. For those of you that may not be familiar with my channel, I'm hiking in the mountains of Japan. And uh, this is called a Yamabiru. Hiru is the Japanese word for leech, but you change it to H to a B when you talk about the uh, mountain leech. Yama, Yama means mountain. Hiru, oh, there it senses me again. Yama means mountain, and Hiru is leech. Together it's Yama Biru. It's funny because Biru also means beer, but this is definitely certain not a mountain. Wow, the mosquito the size of a helicopter just buzzed in my face. Now, while I'm standing here filming this, I, I've probably got more leeches coming in down below. Let's see if we can get a good shot of this. Really need a good macro can lens for camera. There it senses my presence again. It's coming after me. Okay. Well, this leaf is not the natural. Well, actually, they do sometimes come up to leaves like this. But I'm going to go ahead and remove the spider. I mean, the uh, leech down to the area where I where it got me in the first place, the ambush area down here. Boink. Come on. 
Yeah, it goes down, it's off. Now it's moving around down there, as they like to do. I'll leave it there now. See, it's not on me. Let's check my boots, see if I've got any more on, on me. Although the amount of time I just spent, they could easily have gone up. They slip down inside your shoes. They like to go down inside there, and they can actually bite through the socks. I don't see any more on me, though. That lucky. This, this ground here is a little bit drier than they like. They don't the moisture stuff. Well, thanks for uh, dropping by to uh, share with me a little bit of uh, Japanese <coughs> mountain leech ambush uh, behavior. And uh, just, uh, you know, trying to get a blood meal behavior. Take care, everybody. Bye-bye.